nice quick intro here. The intro was cut short because we got some breaking news. Uh, first of all, sharding done by Apollo first, beating Sikiloa, however you pronounce that damn name. Anyway, let's get to the news. I'll get more into that uh, false claim by this. How can I say it? POS. Okay, now. <laughs> it was an article that was on uh, one of the sites. That's what I mean about press releases versus uh, crypto news website articles. Um, the website article is more effective than press release. Uh, so you've got here an author put the uh, information in and claim that they were first, but gosh, Apollo beat them by far. Um, so this is something we'll show you just in a second. You've got Bitcoin at 10,000 bucks down a little bit. As you can see, 1.17. Everything's down to a degree. Ethereum, but not much. Uh, you've got 0 0.09 for Ethereum at 216. Bitcoin at 10,228 or 028, 027 to be exact. Uh, XRP, 2.29. That should turn around next week. I think the weekend's going to be up and down. Probably Sunday start to turn around, um, but we'll have to wait and see how that goes. You've got BAKKT starting up on Monday, and we'll have to wait and see how that affects as next week progresses. Um, we'll have to see what's what, but the crux of it all is it doesn't really matter if it hits the market and brings it up. Of course, it's nice to see the profits. But it is the big news that this was certified <laughs> in mainstream and it's done. State of New York along with everything else for regulations. So that is big news right there for the futures. And physical Bitcoin too, which is nice. You've got the basically the network and talking about Apollo and for the DEX <clears throat> you've got uh, basically everything done on the DEX is just doing testing and then on the sharding they're upgrading the sharding and doing more things for that and that's one thing about Apollo they don't just produce release and let it go they're always updating and this has gone on since last year the beginning of last year so this is nothing new Apollo is has been around for this long time it's a short time in, in the big scheme of things but when you look at the many 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 months um, and talking almost two years now they have been taking care of business fastest network most private and with sharding done first along with on the live active database blockchain along with the updater which prevents forks so Apollo is kicking butt with the all-in-one setup and changing with the rebranding, getting away from privacy coin to the all-in-one fintech big boy is big news. Now, with the uh, DEX um, expl explanation video, some people, um, not, um, not many, some were like confused by it. Others were going, cool, yeah, which is true. This is something that was a preview just to show you by the dev how to do the basics. But what the main thing you have to remember is when you look at the wallet, your own wallet, you will have this piece like this, and you'll have your send Apollo here, okay? But then you have your exchange tab down here. So when you look at this, and your wallet page in the exchange tab, and then he clicks on it, and he's got still in the main wallet. But you're not doing this. You're going to be going to this. And then in the exchange tab, you're going to see this. So you're going to take and do sell Apollo, buy Apollo. Easy way to reference this. Here's your wallet. Okay. This is a test wallet. But it shows you what's what. Now, everything that you got to understand right here is built into the side. And it's the all-in-one for aliases, private messaging, Coin shuffling, marketplace to purchase your you know products with your Apollos and have them sent to your door. Data storage, upload your files. Nobody else has this. Nobody with timestamp. Voting system, um, currency system, asset system to issue your own coin. Okay, you have all this. Now when you get into the exchange, this is something that you got to keep in mind: is that 
this is your big boy. This is going to be your piece to take care of business. And that right there is what you're going to see. So what you have here is basically your buy and your sell. And everything will be explained, but it's so easy once you get this done. Input one, input the next, how many you want to buy. And this is it. Put in the prices. But this will be a lot easier to, to explain because everything will be right here for the pricing. And when you do that, you put buy or sell. And then everything ends up in your wallet. In the exchange, here's your wallet tab. And that will be taken care of with, you'll have off the bat, Ethereum and Paxos, the Pax coin, stable coin. Then you can then send to the spend card after you convert your Apollos to Pax to go to the spend or go to your bank rapidly. Big news too. Division Update 2019, New Merchant Exotic MTG. Tried to find the website, couldn't find it. They have their Facebook page and Twitter, but I didn't see the website. If anybody has that, let me know. I checked Google, didn't see it. NASDAQ, interview air date announced, um, 29th for that. Okay, then they're gonna have the times released. The weekly emails to be resumed. They went out already, yesterday, yesterday, last night basically. A lot of people got them. Major forging incentives coming, which is your turbo forging, turbo charge, exchange announcements coming, awesome, plus much more. This page I'll link down below, or you can just go to the Apollo Medium page link down below, and you can get everything right there. So you have all that, the weekly emails. It, this email setup is what they need to do. I've said for months about Apollo's marketing and that they needed to do Twitter daily. And they weren't. there was days in dormancy for so long of like three days, four days, nothing. Um, now they're doing daily facts and they're doing a lot on their Twitter page. Kudos. Then you've got this going out for the emails. The email is a great breakdown with a bunch of links um, about you know the Twitter, the Telegram groups, and a bunch of other stuff about the highlights. You need to do this. You need to get it out there, and they're doing it. Okay, the planning for Dex listing. This is a cool thing. When the Dex goes live this week, I would assume because um, we're getting to the end of the quarter. This basically what you have is you have a voting that's going to be going in to put new coins into it. So the community will vote the new coins in. Isn't that a rush? You know the XP, XRP army is going to want it. Okay? You know they're probably going to get in. You, you know that for sure. Who else? That's the rush of Apollo. It is going to be cool to watch the building of the coins in the DEX, which, by the way, too, no verification, no KYC, and it is your own exchange. It is in your wallet. You have to keep that in mind. It's not going to somebody else third party and do, doing all that and putting up your license pictures and all that to get registered. No, this is your own wallet in your own wallet wake up start up your wallet oh I mean, I've, oh look at that i've been forging oh look at that i got those free coins oh cool oh yeah let me do this let me buy some apollo <laughs> done oh look at this oh spend card let me send some over to it oh let me add some to my bank all right that's what you've got folks have a coffee enjoy it now, CME Group is launching Bitcoin options early in 2020. Get your act together, CME. You should be doing it a little faster than that, but at least they're doing it. North Korea, screw you. Crypto countermeasures are answered to Bitcoin. Uh, they're doing their own cryptocurrency. Eh, it's going to be good for the inside of the country if they're sharing it with the people, which I doubt, uh, but you never know. A bit exchange delist privacy coins. Dude, now this is a bunch of FUD going around. Sure, there are privacy coins being delisted. But people are afraid of Apollo. No, Apollo's got their own exchange. They don't need these other ones. You got to understand one thing. Number one is Apollo is an all-in-one. It's not just a privacy, you know, power. It's an all-in-one. That's number one. Number two is you've got their own exchange and other exchanges that they will be using and they're announcing that won't have any issues, including Binance. 
they're working with Binance. The application's in, Steve says they're working with them. They have not been turned down. That is big news. Now, the for the other ones, Monero Dash and Zcash, Haven, BitTube, Pivvix, never heard of any of those last few. Um, they're coming off of there. Ripple avoids XRP questions and lawsuit. Will SEC provide insight on Tuesday? We will see. Um, I don't think you're going to see that determined as a situation for them to worry about. I don't think so now because Ripple is separate from XRP Ledger. No doubt about that. Libra unfazed by mounting the regulatory threats. Crypto to launch in 2020. That's what they say. Now, the Libra Association and its partners have still committed to the goal of launching a digital asset ready for, to revolutionize the world's financial system. Um, David Marcus, a longtime Silicon Valley entrepreneur turned head of Calibra of, at Facebook, said that the goal is to launch Libra by 2020, not leave an open-ended launch date that will inevitably get pushed back and back. David, you're going to get push back and back whether you like it or not regulations are going to screw the launch of Libra. trust me on that now getting to this piece here for the sharding claim by Zeliqua uh, they this article that they put on blockchain ace uh, that's garbage so Apollo Core put up the proof um, with the proof video to one guy that said that they were first um, and shared it with them and that's something that you got to see there's a ton of people doing it a ton of Apollo nuts, Apollo nuts going at it um, and that's the thing that they will get nailed okay so this good one guy here was going this is false they did it um, no the proof is in the pudding dude and he says, can you elaborate on that? Apollo Core came right back at him with the proof. Um, so and told him to go to the Medium page to see the breakdown. Apollo's got it, and they've got it first. But you know what? They have it. They're using it. It's official. It's on their blockchain. It's done. Look at that. Conclusion, Apollo is confirmed to be the first to accomplish database blockchain. Look at the date. Da, 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 da. This is the thing you got to think about. Yes, I'm proud of Apollo. Yes, I'm happy for Apollo. Yes, Apollo's going to do fantastic, okay, because of what they have coming and what they've done. And the thing is, this is cool, but Dex is going to be the masterful piece. Africa is going to be the ultimate piece. They're working in Africa for national currency in hyperinflation countries in Africa. And the Dex, the glory of the black version coming. And that piece that's just going to be a rush. Keep in mind, too, when you have your wallet open, you're going to have all the updates coming to you from Apollo at the bottom. So you always keep up to date with what's going on with Apollo. The ultimate currency, if you ask me. And then with the all-in-one features built into it, let me turn that down for copyright strikes. Star Wars. But anyway, all in one. And it is packed to the hilt. And more and more features coming with a DAG consensus protocol. So you've got a lot. And Apollo, basically nobody else is doing anything like this. Nobody. The speed of one to two seconds going to sub-second. The privacy being immense. But again, they're coming away from a privacy mission to a centric all-in-one fintech powerhouse and they'll do more of the announcements of their branding but that's the set basis of it and they'll have more to it of course the Apollo ADF partnership it is for the reason that we have a dynamic but can I speak this morning coffee identified Apollo currency as the only and obvious choice with regards to cryptocurrency and its application to the African perspective ADF group hold on mm. thank you in that small little picture down below there that is the actual agreement, which I have. If you have any questions, I can show it to you. So you have this, and you have basically the future is this. New websites coming too, by the way. And when you look at anything you need to do, download the wallet, check it out. You got the web wallet, you can do it. Save your passphrase and account number. Do not lose them, do not share them with them. 
the Apollo blockchain is clearly evident right here and you can look at their source code right there okay documents where you can buy it Bitcoin a Bitcoin Bitmart IDAX Pro and system coin decentralized bank network where you can walk in and buy your Apollos with cash and merchants being built all around the world so just a cool thing to see that that's building a partner like I said Apollo's doing things that nobody else is doing you have a fan store that's got everything in it I mean everything under the Sun so it takes usually like an hour to do uh, Apollo vi feature videos because of everything they have but ladies and gentlemen this was only about 25 minutes max not too bad <laughs> breaking news coming this week we're gonna have it with DEX that's my opinion and so much more coming any updates I'll have everybody enjoy your weekend